Welcome to chapter 14, Digital Interactive Media, the use thereof. This you should have a real understanding of because you use it all the time. You're kind of in the prime part of that bell curve that's uh, digital natives, at least most of you are for sure. Um, so let's take a peek at this. What will you be covering in this chapter? So you're going to look at the what are the opportunities, challenges with this interactive media. And you get a huge advantage over someone that didn't grow up with this uh, in their lifestyle. Okay, so you can see you've got interactivity. It's more than just you put a billboard out or a print ad and people read it or don't read it. Here you've got feedback that everyone can see. Okay, so you know understanding where and how this took place uh, is, is important. Um, how the audience is measured and there's Lots of techniques involved in this, and it does change from time to time. You know, the rules involved, you know, and how Google searches, things like that, being in the top 10. Um, you know, this is like a whole new frontier, or another field in advertising that's sprung up over the last 10, 15 years or so. So, but it does, does provide opportunities. But anyway, um, and it's, remember, when they talk about the last one, 14.6, pros and cons of internet media as advertising. You know, if your target market doesn't use the internet to search, that's not a con, not a, uh, a viable place to, to advertise. So it's just going to depend. Okay, there may be some international markets where they don't do that or they don't have access. So there's no connectivity. You know, connectivity is not universal everywhere. So just to understand this and it's the mechanics of this is very important. But the messaging is still the same. But it's just understanding that it's a two-way street now. And it's more of an interactive relationship. And that's, that's a difference than just a push media. So take your time with this one. This one should be very familiar to you as you read through it. But you'll learn a great deal about the details of it and the mechanics. So again, work through your project. And... Um, you know, keep moving ahead as we steam toward the end of the course. If I can help you, please let me know. Thanks.